Hi everyone, welcome back on my channel. Today I want to make my first video tutorial. The project I choose is a Super Duo butterfly. I made it in several colors, as you can see. The first one was made with Aquamarine Chelsean Super Duos and Jet Round Seed Beads. This one is made with white super duos and galvanized starlight uh, seed beads and this one is made with rosaline matte super duos and bronze seed beads I think they're really cute today I'm gonna be making the red version so I'm gonna use opaque red super duos you, can do you could also use twins if you prefer them then you're gonna need some size 11 seed beads I'm using galvanized aluminium by Toho you're also going to need two size 15 seed beads in the same color for the head of the butterfly I'm using a 3 mm metal bead you could also use a regular glass bead or fire polish like I've used here or you can use bicon, whatever you you prefer. Then we're gonna need some tiny drops. You could use only two of them, like I did here, or you can use all the four, like in this case. The color of I choose is silver lined crystal. Oh, and you're gonna need twenty six. Uh, super duos for one butterfly. Okay, so I threaded my needle, a size 12 beading needle, on about an arm span of fire line, four, 4 pounds. We're gonna start making the base of the butterfly using the right angle weave stitch. So we're gonna pick up four size 11 seed beads and we're gonna bring them near the end of our thread leaving a short tail now we're gonna pass through all the beads again in order to close into a circle and as you can see the circle is not completely done yet we have to make an extra pass through the first two seed beads okay now we've made our first box I'm gonna go through the side bead And I'm gonna make four more boxes. So we're gonna pick up three C beads this time. And we're gonna enter the same bead we exit from, but the opposite way the thread exits. So we're going down into the same bead. Okay, and now in order to make the other box, we need to go into the next two seed beads in a row. Here we go. I'm gonna show you one more time. So pick up three seed beads. The thread that's exiting this way, we're going to enter from the other side. Okay, and we're going to go through the next two seed beads in a row. Now 
now we have three. Now go on and repeat these steps until you have five boxes and then I will show you what to do next. Now I have my five boxes. In order to go forward we need to reinforce this by passing through the beads again. So we get here, we're going back through the beads And, uh, zigzag Okay, and finally exit the same bead where we have the tail thread. And here it is. Now we're gonna add a size 15 seed bead, our 3 millimeter for the head, and a size 11 bring them down and we're gonna pass through the round bead only through the 3 millimeter. Now hold it and pull the thread and now you have this you see the seed bead, the size 15, is on this side. We're going to pick up the other size 15. Okay. We're going to enter the same seed bead opposite way where our 15, our first 15 is. And now we have this. Now we will not reinforce this right now, we are going to do it afterwards. When we attach the loop, we are going to enter the side bead. And now we are going to add a super duo. And we're going to go into the next one. Okay. Another super duo. Go into the next. A third one. Go into the next. And a fourth, and we're going through the next side bead in row, the last one. This one, like this. Okay, now we have this. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So we're gonna enter the side bead. I'm gonna flip it and then going through the next CB. And we're gonna add four super duos like we did on the on this side. So 
So pick up one, going through the next CP. Another one going through the next. <coughs> Another one going through the next. A third going through the next. Seed B. And the fourth. And going the last into the last CB in row. Okay, so now we have this. We're going to add two size 11 C beads and a super duo. And we're going to enter the upper hole of the last super duo we added, like this. Pull. Okay, now pick up another super duo, going through the next upper bead from the next super duo and pull. Now we're going to pick up two size 11 C beads and going through the upper hole of the next super duo. Like this, pick up another super duo going through the upper hole of the last super duo, and finally pick up a super duo and two size 11 C beads and go up into the first seed bead next to the other hole of the last super duo this one like this pull the thread okay now we have this we will go into the middle bead and then into the first seed bead before the super duo. Now we're gonna repeat the same steps we made on the other side. So pick up two size 11 seed beads and the super duo enter the upper hole of the first super duo now pick up a super duo going through the next <coughs> pick up two size 11 seed beads going through the next now a super duo enter the last one and finally a super duo and two size 11 seed bead and enter the first side bead from the base pull tight okay now we enter the middle bead and the next two seed beads before the super duo ok 
Okay. Now again, pick up two size 11 seed beads and a super duo. Enter the other hole of the first super duo. Now pick up another super duo, going through the next. Pick up two size 11 seed beads and enter the seed beads between the super duos. Again, two size 11. Now pick up a super duo, going through the last last one. And again, super duo, two size 11 seed beads and enter the seed beads on top on the, of the super duos. Okay, now as before enter the side bead and the middle bead and the next two seed beads from the side okay now you're going to repeat the same steps as on this side and I'm gonna show you what to do next okay I'm gonna flip it again we're gonna pick up three size 11 seed beads and we're going through the next hole of the first super duo now add another super duo and going through the next And again, three size 11 seed beads and go through all the seed beads. Okay, now pick up two size 11 seed beads, going through the next super duo, pick up one seed bead, going through the next super duo, now pick up a drop and two size 11 seed beads. 
and pass through the seed beads above the super duos. Okay, now as before, we're going to go through the side bead and the middle bead from the base. Through the four seed beads we added before the super duos. And you are ready to go on and repeat the same steps on the other side and then I will show you what to do next now we'll have this it's almost done we need to repeat the other steps we have to go as before into the middle bead from the base and into all the seed beads now pick up two size 11 seed beads Go into the other hole of the super duo again pick up two seed beads pass through all the seed beads in a row Now we're going to pick up two size 11 seed beads and we're going to go through the single bead in between the next super duos. Again, two size 11s and we're going to go into the drop bead and the seed beads after pass through all of them in order to get to the other side and repeat the same steps now, now we'll have this we're going to make our last passages so we're going to pass through all the beads again to get on the other side until you reach 
the space between the super duo. Now we can fill up the space with three size 11 seed beads. If you don't want to put another drop, or you can pick up a seed bead, a drop, and a seed bead and pass through the seed beads ok now pass through the next ones until you exit the two you previously added ok, this one here we're gonna add a seed bead and we're gonna go through the next seed beads and the drop and we're gonna go all the way around so we could do the same steps on the other side Okay, exit the drop bead and the two seed beads after. Pick up a seed bead, go through the beads. in order to exit the space between the super duo here we go from here we're gonna add we're gonna add a seed bead the last drop and another seed bead and we're gonna go through the next seed beads in a row now the butterfly is finished we're gonna make the final step adding the loop so we're going to go through the seed beads middle bead from the base size 15 and the round bead
and we're gonna exit the 11 above our butterfly head okay from here we're gonna add 5 11 o's And we're going to pass through the same bead opposite way. And we have made the loop. Okay, so I've made several passages through the loop and I've exited the round bead, the seed bead under it, and the size 11. I'm going to pass through some of the next 11 of seed beads. and I will secure my thread by making a knot. I'll be passing under the beads leave a small loop and pass the needle and pass the needle through it Now I've made my knot, I'm going to go through some other seed beads to hide the knot between the beads. And I'm going to do this all the way around by passing through the seed beads and making some knots and then I will cut the thread and the butterfly is finished so I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial and I'll be back soon with another one happy beating and sparkle your way